guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Eclectic Emma here. Today we are doing a glow up slash morning routine. This is really not my morning routine because usually my morning routine just goes like, I wake up, take my hair out in whatever state it's in, brush it a bit and then put on my mask and then go to work that's usually my routine but today i feel like doing something different because i feel like i need am in need of a glow up i haven't haven't really been wearing makeup for like ages so i want to do something different and get rid of this crusty dusty like little moment i'm having right now so first things first let's uh take my hair out of this Oh my god! I just remembered I had soju last night while I was in bed <laughs> for some random reason because I had it in my bag and um in my bag in my fridge I meant to say may as well have soju at what time is it? It's like nine o'clock in the morning. Hell yeah. Rock on! Has anyone ever had this? This is the strawberry flavor. It's kind of gross, but it's pretty good. This one actually isn't in Korean. It says good day on it, so good day to you. I'm also not sure if I should put um, fake eyelashes on in this tutorial as well. Oh well. I am one of those people that look shit with my hair up like I have to have my hair down like for some reason I have a fucking wide neck or something that like whenever my hair is up I just look like a rat like not really a rat but I just feel like my hair looks bigger so definitely gonna have my hair down gonna straighten it do all this fun stuff to it this is my before okay so I'm ready to start Straightening my hair now. Let's go. Does anyone like. Is this how I sort of stitch in my hair? I just sort of put like everything from my top end of my skull and just sort of like tie it in a bun and then sort of like. Leave all this like bits. I don't really section it properly. Plus, I like to do it really quick because because I have quite long hair. Well, it's not actually fuck. It, it's not all that long. Um, because I have quite thick hair, like and it's curly. Like I just want to straighten it as fast as I can because it's like the biggest pain. But I can do it pretty quickly, so that's good. I also need to get a new straightener because this one's dying on me. This is a, it's literally just a Revlon one. Like, I don't know if you know where I got it. I think I got it from my auntie. Definitely need a new one. Let me know some good straighteners. Okay, so I finished this part of my hair. Does it look good from the back? Does it look good from the back? I fucking hope so. I feel like when I'm straightening my hair, like my the back of my hair is always so fucking shit, and I don't even realise until like I'm finished. I'm like, oops, whoopsies. I'm gonna have to redo all of that. And I literally remember when I was like. In your, what year was this? Year nine? Probably year nine in school. I think, but like when I used to straighten my hair, like I most likely just forgot about the whole back end of my hair and no one told me. So I look around like that, thinking I was like really hot shit. And I really think, I really did think I was. That is just the age, my friend. Okay, so basically everyone I know says they prefer me with straight hair. So, I think it 
Love this random knife and fork I have sitting there. Lovely. Yeah. It's rainy as fuck outside, which is props not the best idea for straight hair. But YOLO, let's just hope I don't get it on work. You know what's like so weird? Like whenever I straighten my hair, like my hair looks ten times blonder, like and when it's like when it's curly, like it looks fucking brown. I'm like, what the fuck? Like I pay all this money to go blonde. And then like when they do it, it looks so blonde. Then literally the next day I like wash my hair and I wake up and I'm like, bruh, I'm brunette. But you know what? I'm honestly thinking like maybe I could go brunette, but I just don't know what I do. I think I should like I'm thinking of going rose gold. That might be nice, but who knows? Okay, let's do makeup now. Okay, let's do makeup. So this is on my makeup stuff. I have like, it's literally just like in random ass fucking bags. Like this is like festy ass. Like, and why the fuck is this scissors there? Go there. Okay, so let's start with I use this soothing Jojoba emulsion, which is basically a fancy word for a moisturizer. It's from Ella Bache. Love them. So I just put like, you don't need Bache, this moisturizer. That's why it's like so small. So I use this basically every day. And it's not like a heavy moisturizer, like, it's pretty much just. And it always makes my face look red, but that's moisturized. So, I like to also brush my eyebrows up a bit because for some reason my eyebrows, like, I have sort of odd eyebrows, like one sort of like lifts, and my mum has the same thing, so how funny is that? <laughs> okay, so. Here it is! Really old Australis brow thing. I use the dark brown. I just have this. I'm just gonna like sort of bring my arch up a bit. It's like that sort of lifts my face because my face is all like, like I look fucking down and depressed like for some reason like lots of people always ask me like what's wrong I'm like nothing they're like it's literally just because my face just looks all the time so I'm just gonna do my eyebrows up there like that only something little but like it makes a big difference and I'm just gonna like make this like straight Like, what a difference. Also, I got this like little headband from my mom. It's my mom's, but I just always steal her shit. This is like really in right now, so I would totally recommend getting one. It's really good for your makeup, especially when, especially when like um, you strain your hair or something. Like, it's so good because you don't want to like crease it, you don't want to tie it up. So I like to do that. And plus I prefer to like straighten my hair before doing my makeup because it just makes me look hotter, so. <laughs> okay, so I wanna do like a color today, so. Okay. Should I do pink? Should I do pink on my eyes or is that too much? Okay. So I'm gonna use a really shit palette, but the only reason I like it is because I am broke. This is the only thing I sort of have that has colors in it. And like, I only, I have like three or four different, I have three or four different sort of eyeshadows, but to be honest, I don't use eyeshadow that much, so I haven't really invested in much. So I have this little Sunset by Chi Chi palette. Highly recommend if you're broke. So I'm just going in with this like end color. It's just like a nude color, but it's like also sparkly. I'm just going in with this as like a base, sort of. 
So I'm using this blurring brush. I'm just gonna use this pink color. I've never used this pink color in my life. Let's use it today. Okay, so this eye actually turned out really good. So who knew that this color like looked really nice? It just always looks so dark, so I didn't put it on my face, but why not? So this is my favorite bit. Finally. Eyeliner. This is like fucking from Rimmel and eyeliner literally changes my whole face. So okay, so I'm going in with falsies by Maybelline on my eyes. I'm also going to curl them as well, but I really just call it curl. Okay, so I'm going in with this Clinique foundation. I'm just using a little bit, sort of like here. I don't like to use too much. I'm just gonna use this Maybelline concealer just under my eyes and on my like pimples. I also just like to use this concealer as sort of like a like a contour on my nose. I also do that as well. That's okay, we can fix that. Okay, what's next? Blush! I'm just using this Too Faced Natural Face palette. I love this palette, I use it basically every day. here but whatever so I basically just put on this puma little sweater thing that I cropped myself looks pretty cute Yeah, <laughs> what the fuck guys, I literally went to get some breakfast and I don't have any milk so I went and borrowed my housemate's milk and like ew, a little clump just came out in my period. This is so sad. Okay guys, my hair is no longer straight. This is just the fucking reality I have to go through every time I straighten my hair. I'm gonna go chill watch a movie or something before I have to go to work. Thank you for coming with me while I get ready and do all my shit, even though I literally look at my hair right now. New straightener, comment below. Anyway, I will see you in the next video. Eclectic Emma, bye. I'm currently at work filming a secret me while doing my stretches. I will see you after I finish work. Yeah, the lights just went off. Fuck. Come back on. What the fuck? Ah. Oh, that other shit. It's too late for it.